high. So your first alert, hour by hour forecast has it dipping from 66 to 64 degrees in the next hour. 61 degrees coming in by 7 p.m., 58 by 8 and 57 degrees by 9 o'clock. Low temperatures. We've been encroaching a little warmer each and every morning, starting in the 30s a couple mornings ago, 40s. And now I think 51 degrees will start our Friday off. 48 degrees in Maryville, right at 50 for Leavenworth, down toward Lewisburg, 50 degrees. And Sedalia, you start at 47. Here's your hour-by-hour hour forecast looking at Friday. 53 in the morning, 65 in the afternoon, and close to 70 degrees. But as the days are getting shorter, the evening temperature will fall down pretty rapidly, down to 69 degrees. But look at those winds south at 20 to 40 miles per hour and across the area everybody's going to be pretty much in those 70s with those strong southerly winds but we do have to talk about a chance of rain in first alert future scan a lot of red arrows meaning the gusty conditions by midnight saturday right on the back door but as we go toward the pre-dawn hours there's the rain here comes the front breezes will start to pick up still can't rule out a stray sprinkle to start the marathon off but Things do improve toward the afternoon hours, and we will see sunshine by even mid-morning. But then again, there's also a chance of rain coming in on Sunday. And I know that the uh, Hollywood uh, race, Hollywood casino race, is coming up this weekend, too. So I'm going to try to give you both forecasts coming very shortly. Here's a look at the exclusive First Alert 9-day forecast, 51 to 73 degrees. 53 to 66 with a chance of showers early on Saturday, but I say they should be ending by about 10 o'clock or so for everybody. Windy on Sunday, 71 for the race. Looking toward Monday, a morning shower a possibility as well. Also a chance of rain comes in late Sunday and early on Monday. Then next week, back to the 50s and warming back up to the 60s for only a day before it looks like fall is going to finally make a run for it for a few more days. And our morning temperatures, all of those in the 40s.